Hello, in this video, we're going to solve for the firm's long run expansion path. Let's derive the firm's long run expansion path. Here we're going to have capital K as a function of the wage rate, rental rate of capital, and units of labor. And we're going to derive this long run expansion path from the following Cobb Douglas production function. First thing we'll do is get the marginal product of labor, taking the partial derivative of this production function with respect to L going to bring the four-fifth down in front here and then we're going to subtract one from this exponent on the L term so four-fifths times ten is eight and four-fifths minus one here in the exponent leaves us with L raised to the minus one-fifth power now let's get the marginal product of capital taking the partial derivative of the production function with respect to K take the exponent here on the K term bring that down in front and then subtract one from that exponent on the K term Doing some simplification, we get the marginal product of capital. Let's set up the optimal input mix condition. So the optimal input mix requires that the marginal rate of technical substitution equals the ratio of the wage to the price of capital. And now we're going to substitute in for the marginal product of labor in the numerator and the marginal product of capital in the denominator. Rewriting the last result here and simplifying. 8 divided by 2 gives us 4. And now let's move these exponents around. Let's move this k to the minus 4 fifths into the numerator and this l to the minus 1 fifth into the denominator. So after making those moves, and now we can add up the exponents on the k and l terms. And now dividing through by 4, going to divide both sides through by 4, and going to multiply everything through by l and we have our long run expansion path which gives the optimal combination of inputs at each output level okay that's it